Hey guys, it's Eddie here from West Georgia Guns for Sale of Trade. We got the pink holsters. Actually, we got two of them. Now, the difference between these two, you got this one that actually has a belt hook. It goes over your belt, your pants, and it clips onto it. And the good thing about this style is this is what most people refer to as the deep concealment. It's inside the waistband and once it fits in you have this room that your shirt can actually fit through there and the only thing exposed is going to be the hook. And then this style is actually just a regular inside the waistband and what this does, this actually clips around your belt. So you would have to have a belt to wear this one. Or you could actually hook it to your belt loop. Get your belt loop up in there. And then go back, snap it back in. Now, don't, don't let this confuse you of how easy I took it off. Because it takes a lot of pressure to get it off so once this is snapped it is on there and when you go to draw it's gonna it's gonna stay on your belt it's not gonna come off now let's show them to you with a gun in them this is the one that goes around your belt very nice as you can see I mean it's a it's an easy pull I mean Two finger pull, but two fingers and it will not come out. Same way with this one. This and this is actually the one that my wife is using. She likes this one because she doesn't wear a belt and it clips onto her pants and she can, like I said, she can actually conceal it. So. Easy on off, two fingers, but again, it will not come out. Now, I know a lot of you ladies, you've been, like I said, once I put the picture up, I mean, y'all went crazy over this. Like I said, 98% of the likes was you ladies. <coughs> and this is a, um, this is an area that's, really highly customizable and like I said Peak State Concealment uh, you've seen us advertise for them I mean they do really great work as you've seen in my other video with the holster he gave me with the outside the waistband for the, my Glock 19 but I, I don't recall ever seeing a pink holster especially in a Kydex and the reason Kydex is really popular is because it doesn't give I mean well let me put the gun in I'll show you what happens especially if you're wearing a belt if you're wearing a belt because the guns usually got weight to it so you're actually gonna you tend to pull the belt a little bit tighter so if you draw the gun your belt's still on it and what's gonna happen if you have a leather it's gonna close up and what you have to do is you basically have to force the gun in there and then it finally goes in. The thing about this is it stays open. So once you go up, once you come up with it, say you still got the belt, goes right back in. So I mean that and that's a good safety feature because you you don't if you have to pull your gun you don't want to be fumbling around trying to get it back in the holster. I mean, you need that quick and easy access out. And just as important, easy access back in. Now, he does a lot of colors. Um, you can actually go check out his website uh, and do the little order form. And you'll see all the colors that he does. Um, and something else about this one. This goes in line. This this one goes in line with what I've talked about about the holster he did for me about it could be adjusted up or down. This one 
I'll actually do it without unscrewing it because it actually does have a little give. But a lot of people, now my wife, she carries it in the smaller of her back. And she actually grabs left handed. So imagine this is in the small of her back. So even when she goes behind her back to get it left handed, she can still get it. Or what we can do is, as you can see, the clip will stay on the belt, but you can actually change what they call the cant of the gun. So now you have the pants here, but you see the gun is actually art towards, which would be her left hand. And for you that would actually do it on your side, actually... Where I carry mine, I carry mine concealed inside the waistband. Mine is actually, it's in between my side and my kidney. So, I mean, it's kind of right in the area of where my kidney would be. And a lot of people, they like it there. But what they would like, show it to you this way. Now, you have the pants here. You have your, it would be right in your pants right there, and it would actually be art forward. So when you come right handed, it would be right there. So, I mean, this one is very highly customizable, and the fact that you can actually deep conceal this I mean, that that's a, a lot of business people, you know, that that's the big thing is if you have to, if you have to tuck your shirt in, or you do tuck your shirts in. The gun's going to be exposed. If I had something to show you, I mean, but, I mean, you would see about that much of the gun. So, like I said, what this does is for you people that tuck your shirts in, once you put it on your pants, you actually tuck your shirt behind here, and, I mean, the gun just disappears. So, I mean, that's... That's the big draw to this is, I mean, virtually, you could carry this anywhere. Shirt out, shirt tucked in. I mean, it's just, it's just one of those things that I'm not big about tucking my shirt in, but there's some shirts that are so long that I do tuck in. And, but generally... My, the shirts have been long enough that <clears throat> I can pull the excess over and actually cover it. But if you move a certain way, it kind of raises up. But, um, I mean, this is the thing is you can actually tuck it in. No matter how you move, the gun's going to be covered. Now, this one, like I said, this one is mainly for, I mean, well... This would be mainly if you have a shirt you're going to let hang over because it doesn't have the conceal. But even for a lot of you people that are kind of, you don't mind to be open carrying. I mean, even if you do tuck your shirt in, it's going to be there. But um, there's not much you can say about these. I mean, they're just really, really good. So, um, go check out his colors, and like I said, I can think of about five colors he has right off the top of the, my head, um, but go check out him on Facebook, you can actually find the link to his page on Facebook on our site, or you can go to uh, www.peachstateconcealment.com, and... I mean, they're just wonderful products. I'm like you've heard me say before. I'm big into Tidex because I just like the fact that they're durable. And he is he. And I'll go ahead and tell you guys before you go to his page. Um, if you're local to the West Georgia area and you have a gun that he actually doesn't have a mold for, if you can get his, if you can get the gun to him for maybe a day or two. He will actually make the holster for you. Because, uh, you know, a lot of you people, I've seen a lot of you asking about revolvers. 
Um, and revolvers is something he hasn't really got into, but, I mean, I'm not a big revolver person, but if I had a revolver, this is what I would want it in. Um, I'm just a big fan of the Tidex. So go check out his page, and uh, hope you like the video. Hope some of you ladies will go purchase one. It, uh, <clears throat> I think you'll really like it. Um, and the thing about it is, people think, "Oh, well, it's a hard piece of it's a hard piece of plastic," but it's really not that uncomfortable. I mean, it is lightweight. I wish there was a way how light I could actually show you it is. I mean, it's not heavy at all. I mean, honestly, this bullet honestly feels heavier than this. And I'm not really joking. It does. The bullet actually feels heavier. And this is 9mm, uh, yeah, 9mm hollow point. I mean, that's how light it is. You I mean, you can barely feel it on you. But go check out his uh, page. Go check out his website. Uh, hopefully, he'll have your gun. If not, like I said, if you can get it to him, he'll work something out with you. Hope y'all have a great day. And uh, hopefully, me and David talked about our next video. We're actually going to go shoot some stuff. And uh, kind of take y'all out on the range with us. Or we might not go on a range. We might go do our own thing and somebody's backyard so we can actually do a lot more stuff so uh be waiting for that video and uh thanks a lot